Welcome to today's encouragement from our daily bread. Today's reading is entitled, Not Forgotten. My name is Bill Crowder and I wrote this article. When we think of historic trailblazing missionaries, the name of George Leal doesn't necessarily leap to mind, but perhaps it should. Born into slavery, Leal came to Christ in Georgia and gained his freedom prior to the American Revolutionary War. He took the message of Jesus to Jamaica, ministering to the slaves in the plantations there, and served as the founding pastor of two African-American churches in Savannah, Georgia, one of which is considered the mother church of black Baptists. Leal's remarkable life of kingdom service may have been forgotten by some, but his spiritual service will never be forgotten by God. Neither will the work you do for God. The letter to the Hebrews encourages us with these words. God is not unjust. He will not forget your work and the love you have shown him as you have helped his people and continue to help them. God's faithfulness can never be underestimated, for he truly knows and remembers everything done in his name. And so Hebrews encourages us, imitate those who through faith and patience inherit what has been promised. If we serve behind the scenes in our church or community, it might be easy to feel our labor is unappreciated. Take heart. Whether or not our work is recognized or rewarded by the people around us, God is faithful. He'll never forget us. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Hebrews chapter 6, verses 9 through 12. Even though we speak like this, dear friends, we're convinced of better things in your case, the things that have to do with salvation. God is not unjust. He will not forget your work and the love you have shown him as you have helped his people and continue to help them. We want each of you to show the same diligence to the very end so that what you hope for may be fully realized. We do not want you to become lazy, but to imitate those who through faith and patience inherit what has been promised. Let's pray. Loving God, our service to you is far from perfect, but we also know that as we serve you, that service is remembered and valued by you. Thank you for equipping us to serve. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.